I started thinking about, you know, why do we even, why do we celebrate this? Why are we all here? What's the reason why we're here? I, I think the reason is that, you know, these types of things, marriages, graduations, birthdays, whatever, they give us an opportunity to look back on the choices that we've made and realize that they matter. These are your choices coming to fruition. And they're great choices. I cannot wait to stand up next to you tomorrow when you make the most important choice of all to take her for your bride. I love you and I am so proud of you, Michael. finally here. I have known that I wanted to spend the rest of my life with you for a long time. The ceremony today is just an outward expression of my lifelong commitment to you. You are the love of my life. I am so lucky to have you by my side. You are beautiful, smart, loving, and full of energy. Together we are twice as strong. You make me a better person and I love you for that. I can't wait to see how beautiful you look walking down the aisle. You will be stunning. Love you forever and always. Your husband. Michael. Dear Michael, or should I say, Big Mike, I can't believe it is here, 1717. Oh my gosh, I'm finally going to be your wife. But seriously, there are not enough words in the dictionary to express how excited I am to not only become your wife, but to start a new life and family together. From that pool hall tall boy to dinner and drinks at Pillow Bar, I cannot wait to see what our future holds for us. You are the light of my life, MB. I love you more. Love always. Keep on. here in the sight of God with you as witnesses to join together Michael Stevens Blake and Campbell Elizabeth Cartledge in holy matrimony. Mrs. Michael Stevens Blake. <laughs> <laughs>